there was some shame in TV, John McRae from Lincoln, so penalty win, and we're off to Wembley. What are your thoughts yeah, on the game? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I, well, I, I, when it goes to penalties, you, you've got to you've got to believe that it might be it might just be our year because we've been so successful with penalty kicks. Um, in, well, this season and before with Sam Johnson in net, so uh, so yeah, just delighted. It's you know such a um, such a positive thing for the club, for the fans, for the players, and and for me more than anything, it's a positive thing for the players because they've um, because they've endured such a lot this season. They've had a they've had a real rough ride and they've had a lot of adversity to deal with. So um, so yeah, just. Yeah, over the moon. Just looking back at the game, it wasn't the ideal start to the game. Obviously, Ultraman had plenty of chance, and then obviously going in 1 0 down at half time, uh, not ideal, you'd say. No, it was awful. The first five minutes were brilliant. We were fantastic from kick off, and then, um, and then we spent 40 minutes uh, just chasing shadows, really. And part of that is, has to be uh, credited to, well, a lot of that has to be credited to Altrincham, the, the way they pass and move. and draw you in and then bounce it round you it was it was fantastic but I thought too many of our lads were just off the pace um, in the first half I thought we were we were slow we didn't track runners we didn't press effectively it was horrible to watch and I thought we were poor um, so so yeah we were lucky to go in one nil down to be fair I think the, the stage at the, which the goal goes in going in at 44 minutes I think it was was um, was a blow because we're just looking there thinking right we've weathered it we can get in at half time regroup reorganize um, and start the second half with a clean slate but going in one nil down in a cup tie when uh, when you've been uh, so outplayed uh, was tough uh, tough to take and then second half we came out we gave a better fist of it we probably shaded large portions of the second half but they clearly had the better chances it was on the counter-attack two three four times and again um, but for some good last ditch defending and some good goalkeeping they could have uh, could have doubled the lead but um, uh, but as is a, a marker of this team and in recent weeks we defended resolutely we got a number of blocks in uh, we, we certainly uh, tracked players much better in the second half and um, Millie Ali who's who's you know lucky he's still on the pitch at that stage of the game because he's not been great today but he's got that in him so um, so when you just need that ace up your sleeve him being on the pitch late on was always uh, always going to be in the plan you mentioned Millie Ali I couldn't have left it really much later uh, to be honest to send us to penalties and as you mentioned you'd always back us with penalties with Sam Johnson in there yeah so Millie what a goal <laughs> I mean not dissimilar to the one at uh, Boreham Wood um, away at Boreham Wood and like I say, he's he's first half, and I, I know he won't, he won't mind. I don't care if he minds me saying it or not. The truth is, he was awful in the first half, giving the ball away, passing it to their midfielders. Uh, couldn't get hold of it. Didn't threaten him behind when he got it, and he tried to dribble at him. He gave it him back, um, and and really undermined our ability to get up the pitch. Second half, he grew into it. He got one or two good dribbles, and uh, and then as the game went on, you know, you see him doubling up and and aware of the threat that he carries. So. Um, to, to score with effectively the last kick of the game was um, yeah you, you do start to wonder don't you is it, is it our year um, and then the penalty is fantastic Jack Senior stepped up he demanded to take the first penalty and I wasn't going to argue with him because it, it takes it, as it did last time it takes courage uh, to step up and, and be that leader um, it wasn't meant to be for him today but just added to the drama um, and then after that, the uh, the lads have, have, uh, uh, have taken the penalties really well. And of course, with Sam Johnson in net, you'd always back us in a penalty shootout. Of course, that means we're off to Wembley for the second time, so our second ever FA Trophy final, where we'll be playing Gateshead uh, in that competition. Yeah, we will. Um, yeah, I don't know. I mean, let's enjoy today first. It's um, it's been a long while coming. This you know this this bit of this turning fortunes this bit of luck yes we've we've had it today you know we've had it in bucket loads so I think today um, again I, I want to stress how, how impressed I was with Altrincham and I think you know they will feel um, really beaten and broken by the experience today so you know we've got to acknowledge how well they played and, and how unfortunate it was for them to uh, to lose the game but you know we're going to 
we're going to enjoy this because we've had plenty of experiences this season where we've been the unlucky ones, we've been the unfortunate ones, we've been the ones coming away from situations, licking our wounds and um, it feels like some kind of payback today uh, for all of that hard work and resilience that the lads have shown throughout the season. So, um, so yeah, we're going to enjoy this. Thank you. Thanks, Luke.